Okay, we can see D1 and D2 are on, indicating the power is on. To use the charging function, we need to turn off the switches. So we need to turn off both the switches and we can see the indicators are off. And now we can plug in the Type-C cable. Okay, now we can see D3 is on, indicating it is charging. And if you see the D3 is blinking, you need to check whether the batteries contact well with the battery holder. Okay, now you only need to wait for it to finish charging. Okay, now we can see D3 is off, indicating the batteries are fully charged. So we can turn on the switch to check. We can see the four battery indicators are on. So it is fully charged. Some, uh, it takes a long time to fully charge the battery, so when you see the four battery indicators are on, you can plug, unplug the Type-C cable. Okay, so this is the charging function of the robot.